Good afternoon. Sorry, I'm just checking to make sure I'm in the right group. Bear with me for a second. I'm going to pull up comments. Okay. We are there. Okay. Comments are pulled up in case anybody joins. Okay. I'm doing a little bit of a zoom just to make sure we're in and you can see. And yesterday while I was doing my live, I lost a die and I just found it. So I want to put it back. <laughs> and I have a really bad habit of doing that. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. So today we are going to be doing our fun fold card. Okay. So I'm pulling out this happy birthday. And then we're going to pull out... I forgot to get the stamps ready before time. Sorry. So I'm using the balloon, I'm using the beautiful balloon stamps uh, bundle, okay? And we're using the bright and beautiful designer series paper. So let me show you this designer series paper. Sorry. So this is our bright and beautiful designer series paper. This is on all designer series paper, select designer series paper is on sale this month. For 15% off. Okay. So let me see. I know this is one of them. Let me just pull in the flyer. Okay. So yeah, this designer series paper is regular $12.50. It's on sale for $10.62. Okay. So you get four each of 12 double sided. So this is front and back. And you get this is six pieces. And this is the other six pieces. Okay, so there's all 12 of them. And we're, this is the paper we're using for today's card. So this is just a step card. And I'm going to show you how to create this. Let me grab my trimmer. Okay. So, just bear with me for a couple seconds. I'm a... Uh, Pulling all my pieces and parts out, making sure we're good to go. Okay. So we are starting with a four and a quarter by uh, 11 designer piece of cardstock. This is pretty peacock cardstock. And I am using, um, it's a, so I just literally cut it in half, four and a quarter. So we're going to turn it and we're going to score at, let me turn, open this. So I'm going to score at four and a half, nine, and 10. Okay, then we're gonna turn this. I'm gonna make my, okay. So I'm gonna, so what we're gonna do next is we're gonna go from this four and a, half inch line up to the 10 inch which is here we're going to line this up at one inch and bring in the score blade up there we're going to bring in our cutting blade and we're going to line it up i want to go from the four inch wait a minute my cutting blade came out let me just push it right back in there we go so we're going to do this at one inch and I want to go from I want to go from the, I'm going to start at this score line and I'm going to go up to the 10 inch score line okay and so this is four and a quarter we're going to go to three and a quarter and we're going to do it again we're going to start at this score line and go up to the 10 
Okay. Hi, Dawn. Hi, Monica. Thanks for joining me. Okay. Okay, so this is how... Okay, so what we're going to do is bring in our pieces and parts. Okay, so... So this piece is four by four, okay? Then we have, the, all the measurements for this are on my blog today. Um, oh, I forgot, I missed a score line. There should be another score right here for this. Hmm. Just bear with me for one second. Yeah, I should have did four. Let's go back. So we're going to do, this was four and a half, and then we need five and a half. Sorry. I grabbed the wrong trimmer. This one doesn't have a score blade. The downfall is to having two trimmers. One of mine, I lost the score blade, so I just bought a new trimmer. Okay, so we're going to do four and a half, then five and a half. And I'll fix it on my blog. Okay. So now let's go ahead. And so this piece is going to go on this. Then this piece is going to go right here. And then we have some designer series paper. I have the stars are going to go on the two sides. And then the stripe will go down here, and then I have our balloons that we're going to, but we're going to stamp first, okay? And then I'll show you how to put all the pieces and parts together. So I need pretty peacock ink. I'm going to pull this just down just a little bit so you can see everything. So first thing we're going to do is stamp happy birthday here. And then I'm going to bring in the tail for the balloon, and I'm going to stamp it off a little bit and then we're going to stamp a tail for the balloon here and then this says I think it's time for a celebration okay oh let's start just flip it over now we have to redo the tail okay so now let's go ahead and start putting this together and I will, I need to seal. Okay. So I'm going to put this down first. This is our four by four piece. It's going to go on the back here. Okay. Just like that. And we'll come in with our little balloon. I punched, uh, cut these out using the balloon dies that are part of the bundle. Okay. Now. I'm going to add adhesive to the back of this. So this one you want us to go from the, this is the nine inch score line. So you're going to go up and line it, like give it a board, a perfect border. Okay. Then we'll pop this up when we're done. Then we have our two star pieces. Those are our side panels. And then our stripe will be our bottom panel. Okay. So we have the stripe and then We'll do our stars on both sides. And then we're going to grab our dimensionals to pop up our big balloon. Let me grab one more. Okay. So, this is how our card. I did this white piece wrong. Hopefully it'll come back up. Okay. So our white piece goes down here to the up here to the score line. Okay. You don't want it on the top there because it's got a fold there. Okay. That's going to make our card. Just ignore this piece where I tore it. Okay. And now we're going to bring our balloon in. 
and attach it to our card. Okay. So that is our fun fold card for today. So we, oh, you can set it up like this and then you just write your message on the back here and it will fit in an A2, regular A2 size card envelope. Okay. So if you have any questions, I will head over to my blog and I will fix that extra score that I forgot to type in. And then we will be good to go. You will be good to go to head over to my blog and see the dimensions for this. If you have any questions at all about today's fun fold card, um, let me know. Thanks, Don. I like it too. I think it's really cute. I might have to try this fold, fun fold with the zoo set because I think that would be really cute too. But um, thank you for joining me today. If you have any questions, please let me know and I will put a link to the blog post in the description if you're watching this on YouTube. Thank you.